The only chair in the room disappeared under a pile of clothes again. You can't find anything in here. Oh, where did you come from? Let's start cleaning the drawers for socks and underwear. No matter how hard you try, it's all mixed up. How do you find the right pair? I've got an idea. I'm going to need yogurt cups. Hot glue the cups together. You can make an organizer of nine cells or more. Pair up your socks and put them into the cells. Stop messing up the drawers looking for the right socks. Just open the drawer and pick the right color. Now take a tissue box. Let's use it to store underwear. Bend the edges of the first pair and put the second ones in them. Fold them. Combine a few more pairs the same way. Put the underwear in the box. Now pull one pair out of the hole. Voila! They are already in your hand and the rest of them are still neatly in the box. Now, let's move to the kitchen. It's time to clean up here too, in the freezer. Oh, the fridge looks more like a landfill. I have no idea what's in here or why it's there. It's okay, we are going to take care of it. For example, ground meat in a bag will take up much less space if it is rolled out first. Like this, in a thin meat pancake. The same method can be applied to dough. Put the food plates in the freezer. It's a lot more compact than before. An office paper folder can also help organize the food. Fill it with flat Ziploc bags full of groceries. And put it in the freezer drawer. What a handy grocery shelf. And there will be plenty of room left. Next up is the vegetable shelf. Why is it always such a mess? You are going to need foil baking molds. Put them in drawers. And now put different kinds of vegetables into the molds. One for carrots. The other one is for cucumbers. Tomatoes. Onions. There is room for everyone. This is much neater and more comfortable. On the other hand, it's very convenient to cover plates with foil. The food does not dry up and there are no bad smells in the fridge. But there is one big disadvantage. You can't put anything on top of it anymore. The foil will get pressed down and it will make the dishes dirty. Chopsticks will come to the rescue. Put them on top of the bowl. Now you can put the dishes right on top. No more little disasters in the fridge. But it's too early to relax. Have you seen the lid for this container? Look in the drawer. Oh, there's a ton of them. It takes a while to find the right one. How annoying. A toy spring will save us. Hot glue the end of the spring on the opposite sides of the box. Now you can put all the plastic lids in the rainbow. It's a very cute way to store things. There are so many different beauty products on this table. One wrong move and something will definitely fall down. A regular shoebox will help organize the space. Remove the lid. Take some wrapping paper and wrap the box. Now you are going to need four long tubes. Hot glue them to the corners. Glue the cover on top of the sleeves. It makes a nice two-story shelf. Now you have twice the space for your favorite bottles and creams.
No matter how big your shelf for shoes is, it's always kind of a mess. I'm tired of this. You'll need a big bottle of detergent. Cut off the neck, leaving part of the end. Now you are going to see exactly how useful this can be. Place the shoes in pairs. Place one shoe inside the trim bottle and put the other one on top. Perfect! When stored vertically, the shoes take up half the space. Which means someone has some free space for a new pair of shoes. Or cozy slippers. But let's go back to the kitchen. Of course, there must be plenty of spices for any occasion. But finding the right one in here is a real struggle. <sighs> to keep your spices clear, take plates and cans. Hot glue a can to the plate. Fasten another one on top. Complete the construction with the second plate. And now, place spices around the can and on the second level. Done! The best part of the organizer is that you can turn it around and choose the right seasoning. Aw oh, man, my drawers with hair accessories are so messy. Hair ties, hair clips. It's doomed, it'll never be organized. It will be, don't <sighs> worry. Take a photo frame and some colorful satin ribbons. Place them in the frame parallel to each other and hot glue them. Make hooks out of a piece of wire. Secure them at the bottom of the frame. Now you can attach clips and bobby pins to the ribbons. And the hooks will be perfect for hair ties. Hang the photo frame near your mirror and don't worry about finding the right clip anymore. It's useful and it looks beautiful! Want to learn how to fold your clothes properly? Follow these instructions. Put the sweater on the table. First, fold the sleeves lengthwise. Bend them a little. Now, fold in half lengthwise. One more fold, but this time across. Secure it by folding the bottom of the sweater outwards. Now, a t-shirt. First, fold it like this. Bend the edges. Fold it up again. You can't even tell it's an adult t-shirt. It looks so tiny. Jeans are next up. Fold them in half. Roll up the bottom of the pants and start folding towards the belt. Look how compactly packed they all are. Now they take up much less shelf space. By folding your clothes like this, you'll not only save space in the closet, but you'll also make it more aesthetic. It's great to look at. For the next life hack, you'll need a plastic bell from a pack of tissues. Take it off the box. Apply hot glue to the inside. Glue another valve. You got a wonderful jewelry box. Now, instead of digging through the bag for the right accessory, you uh -huh. can put them in this box. It's compact and it can fit in any bag. Next, take a plastic cup. Make cuts on pieces of colored cardboard. Connect them perpendicular to each other and put the divider in the cup. What do you think it is? It's the perfect snack organizer. There's a different tree in each compartment. Cut the top off a Tetra Pak packaging Cut it in a circle and put it in the cup. Excellent! This lid is easy to rotate. And now you can pour the right snacks in through an open plastic hole. Bon appetit! As you can see, keeping the house tidy is not that hard if you have a creative approach. Which one of these life hacks will you use today? Let us know in the comments. Hit like, subscribe to our channel, and click the bell button to make sure you don't miss any new ideas for the house 
from Troom Troom Select.